everybody. Welcome to New York City and the world's most famous arena. Along with Ray Bro, I'm James Sabalski. The Penguins can close things out with a win tonight, but how important is it to not think too far ahead, Ray? It's only about tonight, but if you win, you punt them to the curb and you get to get through healthy and rested. Both teams are lined up and we are set to get things going. This is what you play for. Moments like this, you... And he's going after him here. Latang's looking around for somebody to fight. He's going to have to go and fill the dance card somewhere else. And it's a much-needed whistle for the injured player who's down on the ice. Miller's going to try and shake this off and get back into the game, but he took a heavy hit there. Crosby's favorite move is switching to the backhand and burying it. His beauty backhand zone ability is surprisingly accurate. Panarin's good at shooting and skating simultaneously, guys. His make it snappy zone ability makes it hard to read a shot when he's in motion. Those are two players I'm gonna watch closely to see if one of them could be a difference maker for their team tonight, guys. Back to you. And that's intercepted by Zabinijad. Into the offensive zone. Passes on over to Latang. Oh, lights out, hit in the open ice. Cannon of a shot, and he says no. Puck is frozen, and we get a stoppage in play. Lots of time left in this period. Still no score in this one. Mulkins won the faceoff deep inside the offensive zone. Oh, what a save in front! Chesterkin sharp to make that stop. From the left side, he moves it up ahead. On the attack along the boards. And now he tries to get it across to Malkin. They've got numbers here. Turned aside with a glove by Shusterkin. There's the whistle as things will slow down here for a moment. Always a good play if you're not sure what's going on. Freeze the puck. I like this save from the goaltender's perspective, James. We get another look at it. And nothing spectacular about it, but a positionally solid, sound save. Still lots of time left here in this frame. We've still got zeros on the board. Dumps it into the Ozone. The Penguins have it now. Oh, that's a good hit. And that's stolen, and they'll go on the attack. And makes the save. And that's off a stick. And now it's over to Matheson. Oh, just a great heads-up play by Strom. Up along the wing. And they won't connect on that one. Some good stick work to force that turnover. Moves it quickly over to Radulov. Beautiful read in the defensive end by Carter. New York's got possession of the puck. Dumps it in. Pittsburgh's got the puck in their own end. Quick feed to Matheson. Takes the feed. Too much congestion blocks the shot. Nice pass. Heedle's got the puck. Couldn't complete the pass. Shuts him down. Radulov's able to get a shot on net there. It'll be good for him to get involved in the play after missing some time with an injury. And serves up a little knock on the play. Bluger's on the attack in the offensive zone. Moves it to McGinn. From one point man to another. He was locked in there. And there's the whistle as he elects to slow things down a little. A pretty good decision here with the play starting to break down in front of him. Jari's on top of this. That's an enormous stop on a scoring chance. Latang's a great skater, even when he's backing it up, guys. His in-reverse zone ability means he can face the puck while retreating and read the play. And they take possession. Nice job tangling him up on the draw. Grips it, rips it, big time stop. Grabbed along the board by Crosby. Broken up by Hito. Through the neutral zone, moving the puck along the side. Dumps it in. The Penguins gain control of the puck. Through center. Puck scooped up by Raquel. Quick shot. Oh, what a stop. Taken along the wall by Gensel. Oh, it stops him again. 
doesn't lose his focus as he makes a couple of quick ones in a row. It seems like a broken record to the truck here. Yeah, I want to see that again. There's another stop for him. Zabinijad's initial first touch on the puck can settle it down so he can maintain possession to make a play, guys. That's his magnetic zone ability, and it helps him keep things going for his squad. And it comes up with the save! The Penguins get a hold of the puck along the boards. Can't complete the scores! Now coaches talk about getting to the front of the net, make it difficult on the goalie, take his eyes away. Man, he only can see the player's butts in front of him. He can't even see the puck. Pittsburgh's got the game's first goal here late in the first. I've liked the way they played most of this period, and now they're rewarded for all that fine work. Moves it on over to McGinn. Great heads up play in the neutral zone by Panarin. Kako's lugging the puck. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Panarin. And no luck on that pass attempt. Here's a short pass to Bluger. Knocked away in the offensive zone. They go on the attack from the left side. Pittsburgh's got the puck. And now he moves it to Rust. Just a simple save by Shesterkin. Lindgren's picking up steam. Less than a minute to go here in the opening frame. They've got numbers, and he easily stops that one. Shesterkin's gonna cover it up and get a whistle. Even with the traffic starting to close in, he had to grab that when he did. We're moments away from getting back underway here with the puck drop. The Penguins take possession off the face off. Misses just up and over. Now, tough to generate a rebound even when the puck misses the net by that much. Well, that'll do it for period number one and a chance for both teams to kind of get a refresh here. The Penguins skating off with a 1-0 lead after 20. Second period still to come. We'll take a quick pause and be right back with more action. Somebody's coming after you. Dumoulin's hit, not a good one in the eyes of the officials boarding the call. When you see the player's numbers, you gotta lay off the hit. He follows right through and he'll rightfully go to the box for boarding. Now, I didn't do this very often, but I was always pretty happy to get to the safety of the penalty box and sit down. As they step into the face-off circle, let's see if they can take advantage on this power play. Great opportunity to get this game back to level a power play, trailing by one. This is a huge opportunity. Puck picked up by Strom. Made the stop on that play. Takes the puck as the clock ticks down on the penalty kill. Picked up along the wall by Rust. Simple stop by Shusterkin. Looking to break out here on the power play. The Rangers have it now. From right out of midair, he bats it down. With possession along the wall. And he was right there, they can't connect. Quick pass to Bluger. Can't connect on the pass. 
New York's gained possession along the boards. Radulov's got it on the offensive end. And not much on that one. Jari's got the puck, and he's going to go for the whistle here. He hasn't had a lot to do this period, but he's been excellent and has been able to control the pace of play. Another look on the replay at a good scoring chance. It's turned aside. The goalie's in position. Doesn't have to make a spectacular save, so it's a good one. Just moments away from the resumption of this power play. They're ready to drop the puck here for this faceoff. The Rangers win the draw. Turned aside with the glove. Jari's on top of that one for a whistle. A little bit of traffic starting to form around the net. Heinen's side still shorthanded here as they slide in for the faceoff. Pittsburgh's got it in the defensive zone. Trying to clear the puck, and they do just that. Oh, I thought they did a pretty good job there, James. That's a time you can get yourself running around in the zone. They didn't get there. Moves it quickly over to Hedo. Handles the puck. Oh, denies him with the paddle save. Doesn't look like much, but the defensemen are helped out by this puck being in the corner. Slides it diagonally to Kreider. Great reach with the poke check by Marino. And now he angles it across to Rust. And that's a great hands up in the defensive zone to force the turnover. And now it's grabbed by Fadoom. Quick feed to Kreider. Here's a shot. Gets in front of it. And the puck stopper jumps on top of it to get a stoppage in play. ready for the draws they will continue to try to kill off this penalty Pittsburgh's won the draw nice job to escape the zone Moves it to Panarin tried to connect the pass but it doesn't go and that's broken up with a stick in front that's using the body on the block couldn't find the intended target handles the puck from the left side to his teammate! Oh, he laid a solid hit on him there. He was waiting for him and laid the shoulder right into him. That might loosen a few of the choppers on that play. His reflexes on display tonight. New York's looking to break out. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. And that doesn't exactly go tape to tape. That pass doesn't go. New York's in now and puts the body into it, a little bumper car hockey. And that's broken up. Taken by Gensel. Uses the force on that hit. Here's a short pass to Crosby. Easily turned aside by Shesterkin. And the goalie covers up for the whistle. That's a great scoring chance turned aside. The blocker saved, denies the shot. We haven't even hit the midway mark of the period. Pittsburgh's ahead, 1-0. Well, that's one way to win the draw as he skates away with the puck after the two centers were tied up. Moves it around along the half wall. Picked up along the boards by Malkin. Can't get a hold of that pass. I seems the call, you know the coaching staff's not gonna love that one. Well, I can think of about three plays he could have made other than that one, but hey, that's the way it goes. Now you need your centerman to win a draw. Officials getting ready to drop the puck to get play back underway. The Rangers win the faceoff. The icing would have worn them down. That's a big faceoff win for them. Oh, how did he get a glove on that? What a stop by Chari. won it off the faceoff. Here they come on the attack. And that's a great read to force the turnover. Manages to hang on. Rips it along the wall. What a save! He'll probably feel that one tomorrow. Pittsburgh's got a hold of the puck now. The Rangers get a hold of the puck in their own end. And now he tries to get it across to Hunt. 
along the half wall with the puck. Takes it to the net, denies him, he got all of it. Jari's gonna opt for the whistle and give everybody a chance to breathe. Sometimes you get running around as the shift gets long, this helps. The game moves so fast now, you don't get a chance to walk into a slapper like this very often, but the goalie's better and makes the save. Well past the midway mark of this period, Pittsburgh's up one zip. And a good read to get possession there with the two centermen tangled up. There's another for the hit parade. The Rangers take it along the wall. Quick pass to McKeg. Slides the puck over. Aaron pass and they can't connect. New York's got the puck in the defensive end. Hammers one. Answers the call with a big save. The Rangers scoop it up along the boards. Puck grabbed by Rodriguez. Looking to make something happen along the boards. Scooped up along the wall by McGinn. From the neutral zone, moving forward here along the boards. Now a quick pass to Sabinajad. All alone! Scores! Wow, what a goal! Nice hands, great finish. One short break and it's in the net. Wow, he rifled that past the goaltender. He had such good speed, the goalie's backing up quickly, but he can't get to the spot where the puck is. Both teams are set, they're ready to drop the puck. So finish adds one possession. New York's got the puck against the boards. The Penguins will play from the defensive zone. And uses the length of his stick to knock that puck away. Huge steal in his own end. Quick shot, blocked in front. New York's got it along the wall. The Rangers get a hold of the puck. Moves it quickly over to Kako. Cross ice pass. And that one's broken up by a great defensive play. Picked off in the offensive end. And he stands tall in goal. Picking up steam in the offensive zone. And he's able to handle that one. Chesterkin's probably the one reason that this game is the way it is. His save percentage has been outstanding. Those are the saves that are gifts from the goaltender. That looked like an automatic goal. He's able to make the stop. Here in the late going of the frame, the next goal could be a big one as we are tied. Pittsburgh's won the draw and they'll go to work. Blocked in traffic. Gets his stick on it. Quick feed to Radulov. New York's in transition. Drives to the paint. Oh, sensational stop with the stick by Jury. Nice move by the goalie to get out close to the shooter. Both teams have gotten on the board, and this one has been pretty much a dogfight through the first 40 minutes as the period comes to an end. Don't go anywhere. Third period is coming up, and it's coming up next. Good save. Still plenty of time left in this frame. You can feel the energy in this crowd. It's a tie game. And as the puck is dropped, they win the draw here inside the defensive zone. And now it's grabbed by Dumoulin. New York. 
Brooks got it in their own zone. Pittsburgh's got control of it now from their own end. Slides the puck down low. Here's a pass down low. Good battle along the boards for the puck. New York's got a hold of it against the wall. Moves the puck across to Panarin. New York's moving it along the wing. Moves it to Gensel. Moves the puck. New York's got it against the boards. The Rangers take it along the wall. A chance on goal. Stops it with a glove. Jari's on top of that for the whistle. Pretty quickly on top of it to kill the play. Kako's got to know right before he takes this hit that he's going to get run over. Fox is able to make clean passes that are easy for his teammates to receive, guys. His tape-to-tape -tape zone ability means the puck doesn't bobble or bounce over his teammates' sticks so they can keep the play going. Picks off the pass. Here's a short pass to Kreider. Oh, it stays out. He got a piece of that one. And it's a quick pass to Malkin. Tried to get 2Q with it and loses possession. We used to call this the tic-tac kaboom. Nice move, but all of a sudden you don't have the puck. Quick pass to Lindgren. New York's across the blue line. The Penguins look to start the transition game. From the left side, they enter the offensive zone. Great reach by Rust. Angles it over to Pedersen. The Rangers gain possession in their own end. Grabs control of it at the point. And that's broken up. Moves it quickly over to Marino. And that pass goes off a stick. Dished on over to Kreider. Grabbed along the boards by Pitlick. It hasn't been boring. I mean, it's low scoring, but man, there's been a lot of chances at both ends of the ice. We've seen missed chances combined with great goaltending, and that gives you a low scoring game. New York's moving it into the offensive end. Puck scooped up by Goodrow, and he comes up with it. Oh, he'd like to have that pass back. Takes a hit on the play, and he gets in the lane to block that. Taken along the wall by Fadoon. And now it's over to Carter. Gains the zone through the middle. Great heads up play to poke it away in the offensive end. All sorts of pandemonium in front of the net, and it finally comes to an end with the whistle. That's an exhausted group of players out there. Man, they're just hoping for a stoppage somewhere as they've been running around under pressure in their zone, and they're going to be able to get back to the bench with no damage done now. Let's send it back down to ringside with Carlin Bay. Panarin's got my vote in this game, guys. Neither player we talked about earlier has been able to get on the board, but despite that, I think he's been engaged and worked hard out there. And that's a great hits up play in the offensive zone. Scores! How you doing? Whoa! They create that speed and that room off the rush. Great shot beats the goaltender clean. Not just a great shot, he's on the move. The snapshot beats the goaltender who's not even set yet. while in motion, had so much zip on it, guys. His make it snappy zone ability is that quick release, and no one was stopping him there. Quick feed to Crosby. Driving right to the front! Answered the call on that play. Aggressive stop out on top of the crease to make the save on a dangerous chance. The Rangers move the puck in the defensive zone. Moves it to Latang. Takes the pass. Here's a short pass to Latang. Picked off by Panarin. The Penguins gain possession. Puck picked up by Raquel. The Penguins carry it along the wall. On the doorstep. Can't connect. Denied by the goaltender. 
You know when you're looking for a buddy in a crowded train station? Well, now you got to find a little puck through the bodies there. Good luck to you. Found it. He got all of that hit. Answers the call big time. What a stop by Chari. Zemanajad's efforts have to be towards creating offense. that he's back to doing what he's supposed to do. The fight is in the past, and... He doesn't need to be doing that very often. That's an important time, of course, to make that stop. You've got the lead. You don't want to start letting it melt away. Attacker on the ice. Big face off here coming up. The Penguins win it. Taken by Jubilant. That opportunity is rejected. Oh, they do it again. And the goaltender grabs that one for a whistle to try to slow things down here. That's excellent timing on that stop. They've got the lead. We're getting late in the game. You can't really give one up now. In the final moments of this period, the Rangers are clinging to a 2-1 lead. Back underway, and they take possession here inside the offensive zone. Turn that chance aside. New York's got a hold of the puck. Quick pass to Lindgren. A shot at the empty net! And the shot dies in the traffic jam. And that pass can't connect. New York's got it in their own zone. Looks to make a play over to Blay. Great reach with the stick by Malkin. The Rangers gain control of it. Heedle's got the puck in his own zone. Pass across to Fox. Passes it over to Blay. A shot at the empty net. Storms into the empty net. How many of these do you have again? Not very many. I mean, you're out there to defend the lead. You're not out there to score, but this is just a nice little perk. Now that empty netter should wrap this up here. We're in the last little bit of the third period. That should be enough. The Rangers add the insurance marker, which pretty much seals the deal on this one tonight, Ray. Well, their opponents pull the goalie. They're trying to pressure to get the tying goal, but it backfires, and the empty netter puts it away. And that'll close the book on this one as the final horn sounds. Well, a big win tonight. Can they do it two more times, though? Well, uh, they can't even worry about two more times. Can they do it one more time? At 3-1, now they've got a chance to try and really get themselves in the series with another game. Well, bright lights, big city, and a nice salute here to the fans in Manhattan. I feel like there's more to this. There's got to be another gear here eventually. A 2.0. Yeah, it's yeah, got to come. I'm with you. Great playoff action tonight for Ray Ferraro. My name is James Sabalski. We'll talk to you next time where the fun will continue.